here once more it's the 14th of uh, january 2012 and we are witnessing a riot in front of the cnn building with the nigerians in los angeles speaking about the issue of subsidy uh, subsidies removal in uh, nigeria and here now we have uh, our sister susan henshaw from nigeria an immigrant from nigeria in los angeles uh, what's your opinion about these subsidies? Uh, well, about? You know, my opinion is basically the same as, you know, everybody else is saying, you know, subsidy removal is untimely. It wasn't well thought out. It wasn't well planned. You know, I've always maintained that the government knew. We've been talking subsidy removal for several years. They had a lot, a lot of time and a lot of notice, you know, to make this removal, you know, if it had to be done, a smooth process. They had enough time to first plug all the loopholes because um, trying to stop corruption or stop people from profiteering and uh, siphoning away oil money without first calling those people to book and plugging the holes where all the money is leaking out from. It's, it's really akin to um, trying to draw water with a basket. You know, it doesn't work. So before subsidies, you know, should be removed, the government should have at least plugged all the loopholes. You know, we have an, um, a list of individuals and all companies that are, that's floating around the internet. So it's not a surprise to the government that these are the characters that have been doing all of this ill, siphoning all this oil money and... They've done nothing about it. You know, how do they expect us to believe that their intentions are genuine? If they, they know the criminals are known to them, the names of the companies that are dealing in oil illegally are known to them, that are profiteering are known to them, and those people are still roaming around, you know, nobody has arrested them or questioned them or anything. And the government is telling us that the best way, you know, to stop all of this is by removing subsidies, you know. Um, once again, it's like the common man having to pay for the, you know, for the sins of the, the thieves. So in yeah. essence, as uh, yeah. all the other civil rights attorneys just spoke before you, the issue is an yes. issue of responsibility and transparency and accountability. Oh, absolutely. Okay. You know, and show us for once. Our government needs to show us that they mean what they say. You okay. know, don't come to us. I mean, as Nigeria has one of the most educated people in the world. You know, Correct. don't come to us and tell us that. You're trying to stop, you know, um, people from siphoning money from oil, you know, so you have to remove subsidy. There are other means to do that. You 